the underground man admits to lying to his readers. But it's not a malicious lie, it's a lie born from self-deceit and rationalization. Even though the underground man tries to dig deep within himself, still he can't let go of certain moral prejudices of how one ought to be, rather than looking critically at who he is. Try as he might, he wants to present an honest self-evaluation of his psychology, but a strong moral prejudice within him finds its way through and in the end expresses itself. The underground man is incapable of being honest, but he also realizes this. And this psychological torment is another source of pain. He suffers from what we may call cognitive dissonance. 